Hey guys, Transformers General here, and today I'll be reviewing Studio Series 67 Constructicon Skipjack. Let's take a look at the packaging first. Here's the front of the box, flip it around to the side, you see this beautiful face. He transforms in 22 steps, and his big screen inspired, and his bio is The Desert Sands Quake is Constructicon Skipjack combined with his comrades to form Constructicon Devastator. And um, here's the other side, you got the nice Devastator logo right there, and you got Devastator himself. But enough of the packaging. And let's take a look at the actual figure. Here it is in his bulldozer mode. And this is just a repaint of Rampage. There's literally nothing different on it. I really like this one better than Rampage though. I really like the yellow instead of the red. And um, yeah, I wanna show y'all his accessory. It comes with a uh, like a little stand for him because he literally have no legs. He's literally just a body like with a tail. But I'm gonna show y'all how you store this on your vehicle mode. In the actual instructions, it does not show you uh, putting these uh, two things together. It actually, let me untransform it real quick. Pop these pieces off. All right, we got that one off. All right, and you just want to split this section and fold these up and fold it out. Then you want to take these tread pieces and just fold them up. And you want to take this section right here and you want to push it down and you want to take the one part of the hands you just want to flip it back and you want to take this do the same thing on this side and then you want to just collapse it back in and then what you actually do with the stand here you fold this bit in and then there's a, a little tab right there that tabs into this and same thing on the other side and you just plug those in like so if I could for the life of me there we go and then do it on that side as well. And then you just wanna fold back down the treads. And you just wanna transform that back. And then fold those down. Come right here, push that down. And then come right here and push that down. And yeah, there it is stored. I, I mean, I really don't like this because it has the hands on the back there just sticking out. And that really doesn't look as nice. But uh, if you look at the box, you can see uh, the little hands like sticking out from right there. So that's actually how you transform it like officially. But most people with common sense just take that off. But let's get right into transformation. The first thing you wanna do is come right here and you wanna remove these pieces. We'll get to those later. And then you wanna take this section and just push it down while put your thumb right there so you can try to pry it off. It's actually a really tight grip on mine so it's not that easy to do or everything there we go then you want to flip this section up and same thing on this side and then you want to come right here and unpeg the arms and you just want to fold that out like so then you want to come right here and fold that out you want to take this section right here just flip it up and over like that and fold that bit out i forgot to do that my bad and then you want to do that Come over to the back, and there's this little section right here, and you just want to push down on that. It's actually a really tight grip on mine again. So you just do some prying, and you eventually will get it off. And you just want to fold that back around like so. And then do the same thing on the other side. All right, there we go. All right. Then you want to take this section right here and hold this section and just bend it down like that and straighten up the waist and then you want to fold the arms down like this and just position these like so and then you want to take this section right here and you remember these these things I was talking about there's actually a little tab right there that picks them to those so you just want to if I get it plug those in right there and then fold everything like it should be fold that down fold that down and then you have one arm done so now you want to do the same thing on this side all right fold that out and then plug these in all right and then push that and position these all right and then you want to take this section right here and you want to flip it out like so. And then you 
get your stand right here, flip this bit out, and then you want to just plug Skipjack onto his stand like so and push down. And he is plugged in and here is Skipjack in his robot mode and I love this figure so much. He's not really that posable, unfortunately, but he still looks very cool. He can, um, he's got a little butterfly joint right there due to transformation. Uh, he can barely move his arms up and down and he can move them out, but he does not have an elbow, but he does have a hinge on all of his fingers. And uh, same thing on this arm, up, out, and um, yeah. He does have like an ab crunch due to uh, his foot mode, which we will get into in a minute. And it was a ratchet joint right there. So you can have him hunched over like that if you want to, but I'm not really into that look. I like my figures, or this figure in particular, a bit more straightened out. So it looks more lanky and menacing, I guess. <laughs> but um, yeah, let's take a look at the head sculpt. And that is a beautiful head sculpt right there. They did a really nice job. But I know this is just a repaint of Rampage, so I probably would have said the same thing about Rampage, too. And I did not do one thing, which is, it's not really important, but this uh, little ball piece, you actually want to push that down. So, um, yeah, that didn't really make a big difference, but I just forgot to do that step. But, um, yeah, here is Skipjack in his robot mode. And, yeah, there's basically not much to it. Um, as I said, it's a repaint of Rampage. And we're actually going to transform him back into his bulldozer mode to transform him into his leg mode because it's a lot easier to transform him into his leg mode from his bulldozer mode. So, um, yeah, first thing you want to do is you want to take this little stand off, take that off to the side. Then you want to take this piece right here and you want to fold it up. And then you want to take uh, this right here and fold it up. And then take this, fold it around, and collapse it right there. Take this piece and then you kind of want to like. See, it's just gonna hit that, so you kinda wanna like push it out and then back up so it tabs into the right there. And then you wanna take these pieces off, forgot to do that, kinda fell off and reminded me. All right, and then same thing on this side. And then, got that arm done. And then you want to take this and fold it in so fold that one in and we basically got the arms down and then you want to take this whole body section and you want to put it right there so you want to bend it all the way over <laughs> and then you want to fold this out and then this up when it's about like right there and do that like simultaneously so you can get it tabbed in there and I kind of screwed up that whole thing because I didn't get it tabbed in so let's just ignore that. And same thing on this side. Great. Right. And fold those down and tap this in like so. And put those in. All right, and uh, you want to take this little section right here and push it down so that ball can come out so it has a little bit more rolling ability. And then you wanna take these right here and you just wanna plug them in right there where they were and in the leg mode, you don't have to worry about those. And it's a little lopsided, but it's fine. All right, here is Skipjack back in his uh, bulldozer mode. And we've already looked at this, so now let's get into his combined mode. The first thing you want to do is you want to unpack these and then you want to unpack this as well. Mm -mm, fold those up and you want to fold those out. Okay, and then you just want to take this section right here and fold it all the way up and take this section and flip it out just like that and flip it up a little bit more. So you got something that looks like this. And then you want to come to the feet right here you just want to unpeg all of this right, right here. Peg that. Flip that around. Oops, I can't do that because that's right there. Flip that backwards like that. Fold that up and then flip it. My bad. Still getting used to this thing. Right. Unpeg that. I can't get it, man. 
all right and flip that back and around like so and then what you want to do here is you want to kind of fold that in and then you want to rotate this section so it lines up uh, with this And as you're doing this, this whole section right here flips over, so you want it to be on this side. And then you can continue flipping that, so it goes in right there, and then you have the little wheel section right there, so now that's on that side. And then uh, you can transform all of this back. All right that back and then this this head right here it just stays just like that so you don't have to worry about that really and then you want to, okay we already did that so now we just have to rotate it flip it like this and there we go all right and transform everything back push that down tab that in tab that in and then you want to come right here and push that in and then pull that back my bad and then you want to come over here and you want to flip that down if you can that doesn't line up correctly for some reason what the fuck Right, there we go. Then you want to tab this like so. And then you come down to this section right here and tab those in again. Like that. Alright, and just bend this back, collapse it like that. And here you have the leg mode constructed. And um, yeah, I actually really like this leg better than Skipjack. I mean Rampage just fits the color a lot better you have all these yellow constructed cons and it's just red one and it doesn't really look as good you can't store this on this mode just so you know but um yeah i don't have uh overload yet so i cannot combine this with him but as soon as i get overload i will combine this with him and i'll show you that on the overload review but um yeah i hope you all enjoyed this review i'm sorry if it was a little sloppy this is my first ever review so bear with me here i'll I'm sure I'll get better at it as I do more reviews. But, um, yeah, hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, definitely consider smashing the subscribe button and like subscribe. Peace out. Transformers General out.